Being brave academically is hard enough, but trying to find acceptance in a society that prides itself on normalcy can be quite a challenge. You really got to know who your friends are. The choir is the, we're pretty sure it's the world's first transgender choir. We're certain that it's the first gospel, transgender gospel choir. Yes, June. She sang louder than I did. She was like, whoa! She was like, right on. She was, she was moving. One of the things that I loved about Joan from the moment I met her, we started talking about these things and finding that she was doing it. Specifically, once I you know, really began looking at eunuchs in the Bible, um, Jesus speaks about them. There's a number of wonderful passages. Now she's including a lot of that information in her book, and I'm so happy to see it presented in that way. And then it was also very, very interesting finding to see how much direct, clear, unambiguous affirmation there is of these people that are called in the Bible eunuchs. And then to further discover that that group um, includes precisely the people we now call transgender. And so here you have the Bible being very clearly affirming of um, uh, diversity in that regard. Oh,